गैस कूल रिएक्टर हेलो फ्रेंड्स इट्स टाइम टू लर्न अबाउट द गैस कूल रिएक्टर बिफोर अंडरस्टैंडिंग द नीटी ग्रिटी ऑफ द गैस कूल रिएक्टर लेट्स फर्स्ट अंडरस्टैंड द पर्पस ऑफ कूलेंट इन दिस टाइप ऑफ रिएक्टर द कूलेंट यूज्ड इज गैस नेमली हाइड्रोजन हीलियम और कार्बन डाइऑक्साइड The gas should be circulated at a pressure of 1.05 to 1.40 MPa. Mostly CO2 is used. Graphite blocks are used as moderators within which channels are made for housing fuel rods. Channels are established between the graphite blocks for the flow of coolant. Graphite is less effective than water which causes nuclear fission on a bigger scale. For this reason the gas cooled core has a large volume to facilitate better heat removal. Another advantage of using graphite is it reduces corrosion and the thickness of the reactor shield can be reduced. Control rods are inserted into the graphite block. Natural uranium is used as a fuel and is clad in a magnesium alloy called magnox. Hence, this reactor is also called as a magnox reactor. The coolant gas CO2 is supplied by a gas circulator and enters the core from the bottom. gas flows through the coolant channels between the graphite blocks as the gas moves up through the core it gets heated up and leaves the top of the core at a high temperature and enters the steam generator the tubes in the steam generator through which water is circulated should have fins on the surface to improve the heat transfer rate the hot gas converts water to steam in a steam generator The steam is then transported to a large turbine where it pushes the blades and turns the shaft connected to a generator. This causes electricity to be generated which is sent across transmission lines to towns and cities. Steam from the turbine is converted back into water via a condenser and is pumped back into the steam generator. This kind of reactor can unload the fuel without shutting down and is safer. especially in case of accidents